BDS trying to line up another play, and they'll make it. Shaiko surges forward on the inside of stock. Find more free movement of trying to make happen what you need to make happen. Player coming down from the actual pick coming through. That's a double kill, triple kill actually coming through from Cyclops, leaving it only up to Shaiko and LMs right now to try and make sure they win this half. He gets one and two down the corridor itself. They're wanting to make that push happen overhead. But in the meantime, they also still need to open up the triple wall on the south. Oh, oh now stopping that. Shaiko's bringing back the aggression there. Come on. Yes, it is. Oh, it is. We almost never see this coming through. Shaiko gets Ayagata. Shaiko gets Suzu C because the man was not blinded. Unfortunately, as the break starts to come through across the top, the roll of the EMP and the pop of the Exothermic will get that wall. And look at that. The swing towards the double window gets Shaiko a kill. Suzu C. Taking the way back in. Likefak is on the kit right now. And they don't have the angle on the player. The response. You have to swing. You cannot swing. And BDS do not lose this. The first map. If he can go unchecked, it's big. Doesn't go unchecked, but does get revenge, at least for the kill that goes against them. Did they just see the tip of a gun there on the little pot? Tuck, there it is, and there it is, and Shaiko is able to get Arkali off the board. A minute yeah. elsewhere, it's a dangerous drive here. There's a fight over the top. You know that it's going to get swung on from somewhere else, and they have to rotate out. He's expecting it, but with 20 seconds, let's not give it to him. You can see the players got underneath. They know where the kit is. They know where it needs to go. The lockdown on one hopped up. The blitz goes around, gets the drop onto the next. Anaton gets caught by a Lems from the far end. There's a Lems traded out. Arkali has one, catches the Banshee, gets caught in the face by Shaiko. It has been blown. Blow for blow and trade for trade and Cyclops. Are... BDS's time is sort of getting slimmer and slimmer. Efac, he's going over the top to try and well, find a that. Shaiko. Or able to reply to that at least. So pretty far is coming through the wall, and there it is. The pickup from Shaiko on the opposite side. That's right, what itself. It... He's round the back of a bandit. Arkuli's able to get one more. Alems, the pre fire comes around, but Shaiko just wins it out, pushes them into a two versus two. So let's see four on the board. The kit's still trying to dig its way towards the site. They've seen that there's a fight on the far end. They're going to take it and turn it into a two versus one. The drop comes on the hatch, and they're able to get a cap can, and that's Bride, though! Same goes for Ventura. You place your uh, utility, and you're gone. A Shaiko finds Arkuli somehow. Thinking to be inside already. Yeah, fantastic take there from Shaiko playing a spot that is named after him. Ready to swing and rock and roll from either side. He doesn't have the support of Pillar as of this. And look at the drop. But it, as soon as he's stuck. He's looking for a fight to come around. pre fires the knees and the angle. There's nowhere he can really go. So they open the skills oh. up. Gets the spray on Likefak in the meantime. Luckily across the board. Shaiko pushes. Cannot handle the recoil. It just whiffs over the head of the player. It's not the easiest. And now... Black Ray slips his way past the shield. Shaiko still doing damage and has the kit at his feet. Still going well for Cyclops this round. BDS definitely looking to bounce back. Anaton now on 10 HP, well, probably even less. Let's give it like one, make it zero. It's going to be only up to Arkeli now in a 1v5 situation. An ace clutch within 35 seconds is what he needs to put on the board if he wants to win this round, but what will most likely become a tactical timeout of sorts. No, not even that. Flaws around for BDS as he jumps in from the white window. What are they piecing together, Cyclops? Well, Shaiko is As piecing together Arkeli's head, pulls himself back in motion. <laughs> they have either side. Suzu C takes the drop onto Moto and is able to take one right inside the kit. Well, there's the swing. There's the little tuck corner. It gets rid of them. Shaiko still locked in. A three versus one now as he is just dominating that position. Black Ray seen there by the bulletproof on the far end and Lems. Suzu C just got wind of it and Shaiko gets the head of Anaton trying to break the way across the position that he held them off for such a long period of time. The super aggressive oh, swing and TK goes down. Black Ray picks up the pieces. A disaster. They're going around on the corner. Oh, oh no. just mistimes the spray. There's the reveal. They will call some support from White as well. You can see there's a player on the bottom, gets the down and gets out of there, pulls themselves back round. And Shaiko gets the lock down. They did not need to keep the swing on. Suzu C suffers in his position, stopping the push from the top of White. Anaton goes to offer some support. Shaiko is still on an absolute tear. There's the drop. There's the continuation. But elsewhere, Bride. They're going to step themselves in, ping the wall, and sort of say the players are behind it. Shaiko with a grenade is on an absolutely monstrous series. 15 to 4. Zygator is tucked just on the side of split. Pings come through. Shaiko gets one more. Drone is concerned about a run out on the far end at the same time. They're trying to offer some support, but Shaiko's inside the site. He's going around the back end, gets an easy freebie, and he looks for the second on the stairs. There's almost three, but Suzu C. Fight can't find it, cannot find the second.
second, and we see Cyclops felling the French. BDS trying to line up another play, and they'll make it. Shaiko surges forward on the inside. Fox is going to adopt top square. Oh, BDS. Wow. Finally able to find a few members of Oxygen that were lurking over on this far side. Vertical's just going to send it into sight, because really, what else do you do in this situation? It's time to take some gunfights, isn't it? He'll get the first one, can't get the second, and Shaika will shut him down. But he has not been able to find any entries to support this push yet. Sweater, however, will be knocked out by Shaiko. And finally, like a fact, strikes true. Opening the gateway for the rest of BDS to swing in here and take full control of the site. May not even really need to go for a plant here when everything is said and done. We're already down to just Fox A and Dream. Scratch that. Really, really fun gun. Don't know if you guys have ever used the 552 commando before but if you're not living under a rock uh then you know it's a very very solid weapon with a great damage model oh my wow. god express delivery <laughs> right to fox a's face and he can't even stop the plant three active players up against vert one of the best in north america that we've ever produced but he can't get it done is where you want to start getting hatches open and starting to make plays around this base floor so oxygen just kind of guaranteeing that that process would happen the drone is out here now. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, Doors. I think we're all sweating there for just a split second. It's like, what the? Oh, it disappeared. Okay, thank God. Where is the execute? Are they going to go for it here at all as they try to swing themselves in finally through security? I gotta do something. Brady is gonna try and put the case down here, and it's all gunfights across the board. Neuros to take down. Shaiko trades back, and all with that 1.5. That slight magnification making those pixels so easy to play around. It'll be a fairly straightforward round there from BDS. BDS having corrected course quickly. It's all onto the slight oh my, movements for man. these remaining Austin members. Brent Shiro finally trades at least one back against Sweater, who had gotten just a tad too adventurous. Ver Oxygen once again has had some impressive early round play here throughout the course of this map, but far too often it has fallen to pieces in the mid and late round. Foxe, though, with a nice scoop, prevents the plant from going down. Nours, however, still far too low on his HP. Towards the actual balcony for Square. This is a fantastic position to try and hold the cross in for the office, and it works out well for him. Nours knows somebody more than likely there, but just not good enough on the reaction time to try and beat out Shaiko in that moment. Be tied up here. It's BDS looking to try and take this round. Regonade's down for Shaiko and a quick kill on to Sweater. Of round, very well placed as well. Is it's over there inside of office. Take him down. Shaiko's going to be manning. Wow, he's going to be manning security, but still deal some pretty considerable damage to Renshiro here. As the rest of the team also getting ready to move in for the clear on security. Shaiko played it back, played it passively here behind the half ball. And as a result of that, he'll now be ready for the swing coming in from vertical. Will win out that first fight. Guarantees a one for one at a minimum here. But will certainly be trying to go for two in a second as well. Oh, no. there it is. <laughs> Sweater tries to slip through the crack of Fountain and take out the player on the other end. But Shaiko's so quick to the trigger. No one paying attention to this man's location. Put some respect on his name. He will end the himself if you let it keep going Fox a down BDS alive and well here on border so coordinated when it comes to these things Fox is he gonna get off the case he will oh he was so very close Wow zero utility supporting this position he has to very quickly give it back up and no support on the blue hold here either despite the fact that we had a zombie barricade pre-position here he hurling himself towards it as well but doesn't seem like it's going to last all that much longer a lot of damage from Shaiko and he'll up the top of those main stairs still need to go for a swing to get Lodgy they're gonna go for it and oh no the timing is missed by Bride Nuris is able to work himself into it Shaiko finally begins to spray back out this one as does like effect keep in mind construction was also never stolen away Oh, Foxy tries to go directly for the duel against Shaiko, and they both take each other down. About the 1v1, suddenly the tables have turned against Shaiko, and oh, he's found the target too late, but still takes it down. And even better, Foxy rotated back down the stairs to support his teammate. Now Shaiko's got a window. He can swing back down. Does he read this own rotation from Foxy? Do they know he's going all the full distance back downstairs? Shaiko, in all honesty, he doesn't care. He's going to go immediately for the counter defuse. Hops off of it when he hears the stair activity. Might have been able to force the issue there, but now back on top of it again. 13 seconds to be able to complete this as once more Foxy picks oh! it and walks right into the angle for Psycho. He'll get it done instead. That's six rounds on the board for BDS. BDS looking to shut Oxygen out of Clubhouse. No overtime allowed. Only three rounds in a row here and a great start for Psycho. 
Oxygen not getting that close necessarily to the outright execute, but the player advantages that they found seem to be setting them up time after time. Again, it's a slow process, but when it closes, it closes fast. Buride already the last player standing here for BDS. Overtime seems all but likely now as he tries to no fend way. it off. Maybe not just yet. Fox A needs to plant now. How's he gonna play this? Aggressive or for the plant? The shotgun pump comes in, but he's wasted too much time. And BDS sneak it up on the timer. What a play to finish it off for the Two billion times. Striker's MVP. Yeah. Yay. That's my job. Come on. Jacob. Sorry. Maybe this is. Striker's MVP, everybody. Maybe this is not. We are excited. Play. I mean, sure. He's amazing.